welcome to the Mega Mavers Mystery Mayhem episode. So this will be part one, which will be uploaded on Christmas Day. So if you celebrate Christmas, I wish you a very happy Christmas. Part two will also be uploaded on the 1st of January. So don't forget to come back to my channel and check it out. So I asked you guys to leave some comments on my Instagram and also on the overview video to vote for the blind boxes and gacha capsules you wanted to see opened. So I got a lot of different comments, so thank you so much for that. You can still go back to that video and my Instagram post and also leave some more votes for the upcoming episode on January 1st. So originally I was only going to open 25 blind boxes in each episode, but I decided that I would open 50 for both Christmas and New Year's. So since 50 will be a bit long for just one video at a time, I'm going to be splitting this video up into two parts. So part one is this part now and in a few hours part two will be released on my channel as well. So don't forget to subscribe and turn your notifications on to make sure that you're notified when the second part comes out. There will also probably be two parts for the new year special as I'll be opening 50 more in there. So let's get started. I know that some Toki Doki blind boxes were really popular. So maybe we'll open up one of the series six unicorners. I also know that the um, Lol Surprise Pets were popular, so let's get one of those as well. Um, some people also asked for some mystery stack packs, so there's some Marvel Simpson ones. Also, some people also requested the Avengers Rubber Mascots. Um, let's see what else is in here. So um, let's open up a Animal Jam, and then I know lots of people requested Love Live, so let's get one of the character trading straps. And people also requested remints, so let's go with this um, beach house one from Rilakkuma. Um, there was also, let's open up a twosies, I know some people wanted to see them. And then also what's over here, a pick me pop, so let's open up one of those. There's also some fishies, there's also these Mopia breakfast besties. And let's see, the baby secrets, let's open another love live metal charm. And maybe a Mermacorno Series 2. A Zelda blind bag. Let's get a Disney emojis. Another Love Live strap. And then I think there's some gacha capsules somewhere in here. But we'll open up another Kirby blind bag. Also a Yokai watch one. There's some gacha capsules. Let's open this one here. Pick out a few random ones. We'll do a Christmas Shopkins since it is Christmas. Um, let's do another Shopkins. What else is in here? Um, I know some people want to see that, but we'll do that one next time. So what else is in here? Let's get another gacha capsule that looks like a Pokemon. So there's also one of these ones here. I know some Marvel bag tags are popular. And let's see what else. Maybe a DC Wishies, a Panda, a Panda blind box. There's also this Harry Potter one. Let's do a Disney secret strap. And what else is in here? We'll do some of these little marble bag tags. There's also this uh, My Melody Winter Vacation remint. And let's do a couple more. We'll do this Pokemon Tokyo badge. And that one was popular. And then maybe also a Swish Delish since these are new. And there's also some food blind bags in here. So let's pick out a couple. Do a Disney chocolate egg. Also, let's pick out another one. Do a Pokemon little gummy thing. And then maybe a Pucho uh, Sum Sum mobile cleaner. We'll also do a Pokemon. This is a chocolate wafer with a sticker. Let's pick out a Puddy Pada gummy card. Let's do another shopping type of places. A smushy mushy. Let's do one of these pet surprises. Another curly one. We'll do two more of those. And then we got another gacha capsule. Another shopping. We got another gacha. And I think let's do a My Mini Mix Q. And maybe some Pokemon cards. Star Wars one and then maybe another my mini mixy cue. So here are all the blind boxes that we're going to be opening today. I think there's over 50 in this bag plus this giant pick me pop here. So let's get started opening. 
So before I start, I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for subscribing and commenting and liking all my videos this year. It has meant a lot to me. I'm so close to 10,000 subscribers, so when I hit that goal, it's going to be a massive milestone for me. So thank you guys so much for all the support this year. It does mean a lot. I'll leave all the links to my Instagram and Twitter and all my other social media in the description box below if you guys want to check them out. So let's get started with the first blind box. It's going to be kind of randomly chosen because um, I'm just going to reach into the bag and pull something out. So it's a bit of a surprise for me as well. So let's get started. So the first one we're going to open is this Kirby backpack hangers. There are 11 to collect in this one. So let's open it up. Let's see which one is in here. Oh, is this, I think this is the Link like Kirby. This is super cool. Let's take him out of the packaging. So here is the Kirby figure and it comes with like a proper like clasp here, which I'm not sure how you open, but I'll figure that out afterwards. On to the next one. So here is the backpack hangers. And probably here's my scissors. Open this one up. Oh, the lineup on the back are these ones here. I don't know all of their names, so if you guys know, you'll get let me know. But oh, it is Whisper! Yay! He looks awesome. I love this one. So we have a Pokemon figure. These ones aren't blind boxes, but I didn't look at them when I picked them up at the Pokemon Center, so it's going to be one of the ones in here. So let's open this up. I'm hoping for Mimikyu, maybe, because I think it's my favorite. Let's see. Oh, it's, um, oh, I forgot the name of this Pokemon. I can't remember, but this looks really cute. Let's take him out. So these are all like Alolan Pokemon. So it is a little figure, which I think will look really cute with my Nendoroids, actually. So the paint job is quite nice as well. Let me know if you know the uh, name of this Pokemon. I think there's something else in here. But there's also a piece of gum, so I'll leave that for later. Moving on to the next one. There is a My Melody Remint. This is the Winter Vacation. And here are all the different types you can get on the back. This one is like perfect for Christmas, except that it's summer here in Australia, so it's quite hot today. <laughs> okay, we got it. Um, I don't know which one I want. I think all of these are pretty cool. Okay, let's have a look. So, ooh, this one is... What is this one? Looks like they're all little, like, shovels, and... This looks like it's a shovel and a little snowman, maybe? I think it's the playing in the snow one. Oh, that's super cute. So we got number one. And I think there's a piece of gum in here as well. I don't think I'll take the pieces out just because I don't want to lose them at the moment. But there is a little lamp and then a little My Melody snowman. A little shovel, which has a little heart on the top there. <laughs> Super cute. A uh, pile of logs. And then also, I think it's an acorn. And then like a little um, snow rabbit, I think. There is a little booklet that's just playing in the snow. So here is the entire set. And then also on the back, you can cut out this little postcard and use it as a decoration too. The next blind box is this Zelda one here. I've opened a couple of these backpack hangers before. Let's see. But it comes with either Link, Zelda, or Ganondorf from one of the series. I'm hoping I don't get a double. Let's have a look. It looks like it might be Ganondorf. Oh, it is. I don't have this one. These are actually really nice, like acrylic straps. And I got these ones from EB Games, but he actually looks pretty cool. Let's try pick out a gacha capsule. So there's this yellow one here. It looks like this is like Bananya, I think. I got these whilst I was in Tokyo in April. So let's look at the lineup first. So they're all like little cats in bananas. I think it's an anime series as well, but these are so cute. Oh my gosh. There's even one in, it looks like a box, but it's actually a banana. <laughs> Okay, let's see which one I got. Ooh, what's this one? Is this the one that looks like it's in a box? Oh, it is! Okay, that's super cute. Let's have a look at this little keychain. Oh, I love this. And the banana is really detailed as well. I love its little face. Let's go with another Pokemon one. So this is like a dummy set. And then I think it might be a card or something in here. So let's have a look. I got these at like Japanese convenience stores. So, ooh, it does look like it's a card, so let's put that there for the moment. And then these are the gummies. These are probably grape flavor. Yeah, they're grape flavor. So let's have a look at the card. Let's see which one it is. One, two, three. Oh, it's Cutie Fly, isn't it? 
but the name is Abori in Japanese, I think. But this is such a cute card. Oh, I didn't know these came with cards. If I knew they were like proper Pokemon cards, I would have bought a lot more. But they're pretty cute. So moving on to the next one. Let's go with some Shopkins Happy Places. Also, let me know in the comments if you guys have any Christmas plans. What are you guys doing today? I think this is Series 2. But I love the packaging for these. They're super cool. Oop, there goes the front. I didn't know that came off, actually. That's pretty cool. So let's take them out of the packaging. Um, looks like we have a pink little plate, which is nice. I haven't seen that one before. And then I hope we can get a limited edition. I don't know if we can, but let's hope for it. So this is the home collection. Let's open up the packaging and see which ones we've got. So first up, it looks like we have a little like pooper scooper, is it? That's pretty cute, actually. It looks like it's a little dog. Let's look at the next bit. This is a tiny piece. Whoa. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> that's actually so adorable. Who knew poop could be so cute? Oh, then there's the little like handle. So it is from Puppy Patio and it is the poop scoop tray, the poop scoop and the poop. <laughs> I really like that set actually. I haven't gotten that one before. So there is the really cute happy places. I need to get more of these actually. I really do enjoy this series. I hope that they bring the Disney series to Australia because they would be really cool. So there is the Pooper Scooper. Okay, so next up, let's go with a Pretty Putter blind bag. These ones come with the cards you can use in the arcade game in Japan. Unfortunately, I'm not in Japan. I live in Australia, so I will just have to collect the cards instead. But they also come with gummies and these ones are great flavored as well. So let's uh, turn it this way. Oh, I don't. Okay, let's just look at the card. <laughs> oh, I can't remember who this character is. I think she's a new character, but look at that. That is so pretty, like the holographic on that. And it, I think it's a super rare, so it must be a pretty rare card, which is pretty cool. But I love these boots. So like if you play the arcade game, you get the boots in the game. And then also let's have a look at these gummies. I think they're little hearts, but they've kind of melted. <laughs> I've had them for quite a while, so they've melted and kind of gone out of a heart shape, but they still look pretty nice. Well, the grape smell is really strong. I can smell them from here. So let's open up the next one. Let's go with a Avengers blind box. This is one of the character rubber mascots. And I got this when I was in the exhibition in Tokyo. It was in Roppongi Hills in Modi Tower. And I have a vlog of it if you guys want to see it, but it was really cool. So let's open up this. I hope I get Cap or Loki or Black Widow because they're probably my favorites. So let's see who it is. Ooh, is it Loki? Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy. Have you guys seen Thor Ragnarok? Let me know if you have, but I thought it was one of the best Thor films that I've seen. And it's definitely one of my top Marvel movies now. I thought it was hilarious. Let's take Loki out of the packaging. Ah, I'm so happy that I got him. <gasps> oh, he looks super cool and he has like the scepter here. And then also on the back, you can attach the little keychain. So I'll do that afterwards, but he looks awesome. Oh, I love this. And then also has the Marvel logo on the back. Let's go with a Love Live one because I know lots of people love Love Live and I love it as well. So <laughs> these ones were pretty popular, but I hope I get Umi because she is my best girl for the original series. So let's see. I think this might be Kotori though, but I wouldn't mind because she's my second favorite, but let's see. Oh, it's Rin. Oh, she is super cute though. And this is a gorgeous charm, but and you can also hang it because it has a little lobster clasp, but this is little Rin. I'm gonna go with a Smushy Mushy. So I actually found these recently here in Australia at Kmart and I have a vlog of that um, that should be up soon because I'm doing Vlogmas as well. So it comes with a big squishy, a little bestie, a tag, a small container and then a sticker I think. So let's open this up and see what's in here. Ooh, looks like we have an orange bottle. I love the packaging for these, they are so cool. Oh, you can even see its little face. Oh, that's so cool. This is the first time I'm opening any of these, so I'm super excited. So here is the bottle. Oh, I love this. It also has the website, and then look at that. It's a little maple syrup jar. Okay, let's open it. it kind of rattles a little bit. Oh, there is the little bottle. So it's a little orange bottle with two little keychains in it that you can use to hang them up. 
That's really cute. So here is our mystery bestie. So that's a surprise one. But let's take this one out first. Oh, it's a little pig. Oh my gosh, I'm in love with this. But there is a mini surprise. But oh, look, it's so cute. Oh, I love this. And then it also comes with a little um, keychain strap. But let's squish it. Oh, it's really slow rising. That is so cute. Oh, I love this. Okay, let me see if it has a smell. Oh, it does have a smell. I don't know what it smells like, but it's really sweet and it smells good actually. So there is the little squishy. And then here is the container. And I think that that's a sticker at the bottom, so I won't take that one out. And then this is the back here, so you can put a little name tag on it. And then here is the checklist. So you can also find your smushy mushy name. But I won't turn over the back yet because I want to have a look at the mini surprise. Let's see who is in here. Oh, it's a little like pancake. That's so cute. So this one is also squishy. Not as slow rising, but it's so cute. I don't think I have any squishies that are this small. This one also has the same sort of scent. Oh, that's so cute. They both have little butter bits on them as well. Let's have a look at the checklist. So here is the checklist. So it looks like we got Popsy Piggy and Pumpkin Pancake. Oh, they're adorable. They're so cute. I really want to get the Bitsy Bunny though. So let's move on to the next blind box. Let's have a look at the Star Wars light up lightsabers. I recently watched The Force Awakens and I really loved it. So I want to see The Last Jedi now as well. Let's open up this. I think, yeah, they actually do light up. So let's have a look at who we got. Oh, these are really heavy actually. I've never opened up any of these before. But oh, it's a red one. So it looks like, did we get Darth Vader's? I think we got Darth Vader. Oh, that's really cool. Okay. Oh, we did. And it's like a little cutout, like a little mini poster. Let's have a look at this. I'm super excited to see if this lights up properly. So it's also a little keychain. So here's the little pull tab. Let's pull that out and turn it on. Where's the button here? Let me see. Where's the button? Okay, ready, set. Oh, does it work? Does it work? Oh, don't tell me it's broken. Oh no. Maybe I need batteries. Oh no, don't tell me it's broken. No, I don't think it works. I'll have to have a look at this and if I end up getting it to work, I will put it on my Instagram or something like that, but it looks like the battery might be dead. I have had this for quite a while, so that may be why, but let's move on to the next blind box anyway. So the next one is a animal jam one and it comes with one pet, one accessory, one checklist and one game code. So let's open up this one. I love the packaging for these as well. They're like little mini cupcakes. Okay, so we pull and twist it here. Twist off. Ooh, which one did we get? Let's see. Looks like, is it like a turtle? I don't know, it comes with a donut. This is Bright Plum 3, Series 3, number 40. It's a jellyfish. So here is the code and it says, did you know most jellyfish have tentacles that are covered in stinging cells? So I think the little donut goes on its head here. That is so cute. So let's move on to the next blind box. Let's pick out a random one. Looks like we have some more Shopkins. So these are season seven. Just gonna rip into it. Okay, these are the two boxes. There's the checklist. So I don't think I've ever opened up any series seven, which is surprising since I usually open up a lot of Shopkins, but that is a super cute box. So let's open up this one. Ooh, so we have one blind bag in here. So here we have. Oh, it's a little purse and it's glittery. I really like this shop. It has like a little flower or butterfly on the back. Oh, I love that one. And now let's open up the pink box here. Let's see who's in this one. Let's get my scissors again. And let's see. Oh, it's a little cake. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, I love that one too. And it has like all my favorite colors. They're all purple. 
Okay, let's look at the checklist and see which ones these are. We have Queenie Cake from Princess Party, which is number 46. It looks like we have Paige Purse. So Paige Purse is actually a ultra rare, which is really cool, and she's sparkly as well. So that is one of the first times I'm getting an ultra rare from this series, which is nice. And then the other cake one, Queenie Cake, is a common. Onto the next blind box, let's go with a My Mini Mixi Q. So these are a two pack from series one, I think. Let's open this one up. So there is the bag and there's also the checklist here. Ooh, these ones are quite colorful. So let's put on this one's hair. And then this one, I'm not sure if I've gotten these ones before actually. Let's have a look at the checklist. So the first one that I got is the Artist from the Zany collection, and she is a Everyday. And then the second one here is a Boho, and she is also an Everyday. And they both have really cute outfits, and they're super colourful. So here are the two My Mini Mixi Qs. This is a pet surprise. So there are 10 to collect, and it comes with a surprise toy, a candy, and a sticker. I haven't opened any of these before either, so it'll be interesting to see what they're like. I love that the design's like a little barn. I think that's pretty cool. Does that open here? Oh, it does! Wow! Okay. So, it looks like we have a little horse figure, which is quite cute. And then there's some candy in here, which also look like little animals. And then, let's see if I can get this out. Looks like this might be a checklist. And then there's like little um i think these are meant to be like gates but i'll leave them in there for the moment does it come off at the top or something but here is the checklist there's this sticker which is the horse and then here is the checklist here so it's actually quite cute there's a pig a rabbit a carrot a donkey a hedgehog oh i want the hedgehog a sheep a horse a wild boar a cow and then a haystack so this is actually quite cute i love this little horse and on to the next one. There is a Marvel Heroes like tag kind of thing. I don't know how you explain these. You're meant to like stack them together, I think. But I think I've gotten most of them, so I don't know if I'll get any uh, new ones. Let's have a look. Oh, it's actually Valkyrie. I don't think I have her. So yeah, yeah, I actually got a new one, which is pretty cool. But you're meant to like stack them together with the joints here. But she looks awesome. Let's go with a Sum Sum chocolate egg. I probably won't eat the chocolate out of this one because it is kind of a bit old now, but let's get the figure inside. So here is the capsule. I can't remember what comes in these ones, but I think it might be a Sum Sum or a different Disney figure. Let's open this one up. Oh, it looks like we have Sully. So these are little buildable figures, but yeah, we got a little Sully Sum. So I put Sully's little tail and spikes on and he is so cute. Oh, I love this little Sum. So you can also have him sitting off the little stand, but I think he looks really cute displayed like that. So there is little Sully. Let's go with a Toosies. I haven't opened up one of these in a really long time. So these are from series one, I think. This looks like it's the baby friend first, I think. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's a little bird. I think it's a toucan. I hope it's a matching one, but it might not be likely. Oh, so it's a little wolf, I think. So the first one here, I think, is Jojo, and it is a common. And then the little toucan is Beaky, and I think he's a rare, so that was pretty cool. We're getting a couple of rares and ultra rares in this unboxing, so I'm really happy about that. Let's do another Love Live. So this is the cheerleader strap version, and I'm hoping for Yoshiko because she is my best girl, or Daya. But here is the ones on the side. So let's open up this. One, two, three. Oh, it's Hanamaru. She's not my favorite, but she is so cute. I love the little pink bows that she has. I might have to try and trade her for Yoshiko or Daya. So if I have any things to trade, I'll leave information about them in the description box. So that is the end of part one of this Christmas special. I'll be uploading part two really, really soon. So don't forget to check back in a few hours or turn your notifications on to be notified when part two is released on my channel. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this part one of Mega Mavis Mystery Mayhem. I hope you all have a wonderful holiday season and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.